Tasting like a boss. How are you guys doing? It is Christmas Eve. I have middle daughter of boss with me. And this is a review that I'm actually proud of her for doing. She's not somebody who's into really hot, spicy things. I really don't know if these things are Hold going on. to be massively When hot, we spicy. were younger, we would go to restaurants and my dad would make me and my older sister, usually not my little sister, do hot sauce competitions with the hot sauce at the table, put it on a spoon, and see how long we could keep it in our mouth, and the winner like got a dollar. It's like the, it was like the so. clear fluid that had the pepperoncini things in it. It's like nothing. sometimes it was like Tabasco or habanero. I don't remember that. It was not habanero. <laughs> no, no. Yes, it was. Whatever. Wait, not habanero. I meant Cholula. I don't know. I don't think that's true. But whatever. Hey, whatever. I block out all the abuse I did to you. All right, here we go. We are trying some sauces from a place which is Spice is Nice. You can find them on Instagram at Spice is Nice Grocery. Spice is Nice Grocery. We actually went in uh, to the place. It's in downtown Sanford. Uh, if you guys are in Sanford, there's, you really he should He was wearing go. this outfit while he was there, too. I, I was wearing this so outfit. So if that person, if he sees this, he'll be like, he was wearing that. He's like, he's like, does he always wear that? It feels like I'm yes. always wearing it. Uh, so we went here, and it turns out this guy, uh, he makes his own sauces, but his place is not dedicated to just his product. His place is a lot like a pepper palace uh, kind of place where it's got all the different sauces and then like chips and chocolates and uh, even some spice challenges like death nut challenge. And I think they had tube of terror. So he's a guy who sells all kinds of spicy things, but I knew that he made his own hot sauces because a friend of mine mentioned it. And in fact, I had seen the guy's stuff because uh, he used to be the CEO of the Sanford Zoo. So he was selling some of the stuff in that gift shop, but I figured I wanted to get it from the store itself. So I walked in. The guy's really name nice was guy. Dino. Dino? Dino. And I asked him, uh, of your sauces, and by the way, he's got a huge store. His sauces go from like here to here. So he's not making a billion sauces. And I asked him if, you, if I could, if you could provide me two things. One, your most unique sauce, and two, your hottest sauce. Not the hottest sauce that you sell in the store, but the hottest sauce that you make, because he makes them there in Sanford. So he gave me two. He gave me one, which is a uh, purple haze, which is here. Lavender. And on the back, it shows just out of four peppers, it has two. Uh, and it appears to be a blueberry hot sauce. And in the back, it has blueberries, apple cider, vinegar, onion, water, uh, and the pepper is Fatali pepper. Uh, yeah, Fatali pepper. Salt, garlic. So I don't think this is gonna be a really hot sauce. It does say the shake well done. I'll shake it, you can talk about that one. You shake it up? No, we'll get to that one next. So we're gonna try this one first. And this, this is gonna be the unique sauce, which I don't think you should have a problem with at all. I don't think I have a problem at all. We just had a blueberry sauce. It was blueberry ghost pepper, but that had some heat to it. I'm thinking this one here this probably This one actually won't. does smell like it. Would but it has, I can tell you, it has chunks too. Not as chunky as the last one we I had. Like you need to try it before. Oh, but it does That's look a like, lot. That's a lot. I know, but you That's poured it. That's a lot. From not, I'm not asking you to do it. Look how much you put on that. It's just, it's not even full. This isn't even completely full. I was thinking like that. Okay, that's all you need to do. I want to taste it more for me. Okay. All right, so it tastes like a boss. Wait, and this is, was it the purple it say, haze? How many? Two out of four? Two out of four. All right. Purple haze. Here we go. Oh, and, and by the way, the, the, the spice, I should tell you this, the spice uh, name is hotter than L, E-L, so hotter than L. All right, tasting like a boss. I really like that. Oh yeah, it's not spicy. I, I mean, mean, it's spicy. It's spicy, but it's not like... <laughs> it's not like I was like... Uh. Wait. It's high, It's hotter than Texas P. It's hotter than Chaluda. So I actually like. really like it. Isn't it really good? It's so fresh. Like... That wow. might be like my favorite hot sauce I've ever tried. You know, I will say that the other blueberry one that had the ghost pepper, I detected more of the blueberry at the end, but I like, this is more balanced. That's a really good sauce. You know, the first ingredient again is blueberries, just like the other one we had, which was a ghost pepper. But you know, I'll tell you what, if I had to pick between the two, you know, I might have to do a side-by-side -side comparison at some point. I really point. like it. In fact, I'm going to do that. I promise you guys, I'm going to do a side-by-side -side of this and the other one I had. But, uh, yeah, that's really good. Well done. So, that's worth the purchase right there, guys. I so, would put that hotter on than stuff. L. 
Now the next one, you may want to cleanse your palate. I don't know. She's got some hint water there. This is the one he said is his hottest sauce. So it has four peppers and then some and then some fire at the end. So I don't know if that means it's hotter than that, but he said this is his hottest one. And I'm interested with this one because this one started out with the main ingredients as blueberries. This one here, which is called Hotter Than L Love Burns. Um, and he, he actually, when I asked him which, which his hottest sauce was, he was kind of comparing between two, but he ultimately came with this one. And so the main ingredients on this start out with not like a fruit and not vinegar. It starts out with red seven pot primo pepper mash. Then it has uh, and vinegar, reaper pepper mash, Trinidad scorpion pepper mash. Well, I'm literally all scared. So there's a lot of, listen, there's a lot of hot peppers in here and it's let up front, but it's more liquidy than uh, some of the pepper sauces I see that are really heavy on mash. So you can definitely see the peppers in it, but it's still somewhat liquidy. So it's not like a paste. Some of them I'll, uh, I'll try and they're just like paste. Oh, but no, that being said, you see there is a lot of mash in there. So that's good for me. All right. For you. It's got a good pepper smell. Bro, that's enough. That's it. I'm not asking you to do this much. And I think this might be a bad idea for me. I'm not kidding. I'm not a huge spice guy. Um, I like spice. You have to go to church later and you're going to poop your pants. <laughs> I'm going to poop my pants. Yes, you are. But if I did, that'd be great. It'd be hilarious, right? That would totally make the next uh, family update letter. Might as well get some of it out of I was now. just going to do a dot. Well, good. All right. So this is... My stomach is... already hurts. Like that wasn't bad, but my stomach so hurts. So this is love burns. I have acid reflux. I would just like to put that out there, and this triggers it every time. Well, I think this is going to make me hiccup. There's no doubt. Okay, but let's go. Let's do it. This ruins my makeup. I'm going to be mad. <laughs> ruins your makeup. All right. Tastes not like a boss. Here we go. Oh, it smells good, though. Very peppery. All right. Tastes not like a boss. It is hotter. It is. Wow. Got in the back of my throat. This is not the hottest sauce I've ever tasted, tasted, but it's really good, and it's building. <laughs> Ooh, see, I told you I was gonna hiccup. I don't like it. I don't like it. Is it? Ooh. Is it hot? Too hot? Yes. Is it too hot? <laughs> it is a hot sauce, man. <gasps> oh my gosh. It sounds like you're dying. It does. It's it's my nose is watering. The picture is a skeleton gripping a heart. Sacred my heart. <laughs> it's gripping like right here. It's like uh, oh my gosh. That has a good taste, but it is hot. Oh man. That's hotter than I thought it was gonna be. Hold on. Well done. It triggered endorphins, man, guys. So now the heat's coming in. Where's the ice cream? Woo! Uh, I do want to rub my eyes out. I don't think I got anything on it, but I don't want to get it. That is good, guys. But it is hot. He said, hey, he, he really uh, prides himself. He prides himself on balance, flavor, and heat. And he does, you can tell, because even in his hottest sauce, there are other sauces out there that are just reliant heavily on extract or they're reliant just on heat with no flavor. This is, if I need to compare it to something. Death. No. I think this sauce is a lot like the flavor dynamics of on hot ones the last dab but not apollo the apollo one i wasn't a huge fan of there was one before that i really liked the flavor you had that fresh taste and then the last dab sauce is that the hottest sauce like type is that like the hottest same level as 
Hot on hot ones? This here, I think is comparable. If you want, we can actually try that sauce later while you're here and you can compare it because I have it. You okay? Yeah. Did you I have sore in my mouth. Oh, I thought you lost a filling or something. I'm like, great. I don't have any fillings. Oh, oh, oh I'm sorry. Perfect teeth. Miss Perfect Teeth here. I'm sorry. Are Whatever. fillings that you get when you have cavities? Huh? Yes. I do have fillings. Okay. You suck, man. <laughs> anyway, so. I thought you were talking about crowns. No, no crowns. Okay, so. This is a really good sauce. Hands down. I'm going to try this on a side-by-side -side with the other blueberry one we did that was blueberry and ghost pepper and see which one I like more. But you have to wait for my verdict. Get this. Wait. So After this, can, this is a good hot sauce, if man. If I can have this, could I handle hot ones? Is that what you're saying? I think you can handle the last sauce on hot ones, but I do not think you can handle the bomb, which is eight. The bomb, I, I don't think... I. It's not necessarily the Scoville level of the bomb. The bomb it, has right? no redeeming quality to it. It's just, it doesn't taste good and it's just heat. I think it's because didn't it relies. Lord, didn't Lord do that one? Lord didn't Fine. react to anything. Did you know Lord's name is Ella? I did not know. Obviously, Lord is her stage name, but Ella's her real name. Oh, well, there you go. So I could do it. Yeah. So you're saying Lord is my second. Actually, third favorite singer who's named Ella. Is that it? You mean by Ella Fitzgerald? You're number one. Then Ella Fitzgerald. I think Ella Fitzgerald Lord. takes the cake. Well. But I, I, I appreciate it. Ella Fitzgerald You're a little awesome. biased. I am a little biased. But anyway, I know this video is getting really long. But I just love having you here. And uh, the uh, it's a good thing she's not vegan anymore because... Uh, she would have no relief whatsoever. Are you, does it still hurt for you or are you okay? No, it's fine. I just like the ice cream. Yeah. Was that the hottest hot sauce you like ever had? Like my stomach still burns a little. Like I still feel like I'm going to throw up a little. Was this the hottest hot sauce you ever had? Yes. Okay. Well, at some point, guys, we're going to have to do a side-by-side -side of this and Apollo with a last dab with her and see. Because I, I have to remind myself. I kind of want to try to bomb. You want to? I really don't think you do. Like a little speck of it. Ugh. Well, sounds like we might have some fun pepper stuff ahead. I didn't think you were going to become my pepper person, but okay. And you now have to, I have to do it. Nevertheless, she persisted. Well, am I right? Now, what's going to happen is eldest daughter of boss is going to demand that she tries the sauce and she's going to be like this. This is nothing. And inside, like, she's gonna be, inside, she's going to be like this. <gasps> <No>. <laughs> yeah, literally. But, you know, my hiccups are gone. Uh, get the ringing in the ears. That's a solid sauce. Um, like, why would you want to do that? Like, my hiccups are gone. I'm not hearing things anymore. And my stomach doesn't hurt. So, like, why well, would you want that? Why? The stomach could still hurt later. At church. At church. You're going to turn over and be like, it's happening. <laughs> it's happening. It's happening. All right. It's the body of Christ. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Well... I'm sure we'll be doing another review soon. Until next time, keep tasting like a boss. And uh, Spice is nice. Go check them out on their Instagram. Uh, oh, you know what? I think they have it here. You can go to Hotter Than L. H-O-T-T-E-R-T-H-A-N-E-L at gmail.com. That's the email. Or just hotterthanl.com for the website. And their number, I'll give it to you. In case you want to contact them, get some right now. It's... Christmas Eve, guys. No, nothing like having some regrets in the new year. 504-415-7160. Get yourself a bottle. Until next time, keep tasting like a boss. Thanks, guys.